Hi, I'm Holly, food editor at MyRecipes.com. Dinner tonight will show you how to make a healthy and delicious supper in less than 45 minutes. Hi, I'm Holly Granger, food editor at MyRecipes.com. Dinner tonight is a quick comfort dish. It's cooking light, speedy chicken pot pie. Let's start. Cook chicken in a hot skillet for about five minutes or until it's done. Just sprinkle the chicken with some salt and then give it a stir. To save time, overlap your steps. So while the chicken cooks, bring broth and a bay leaf to a boil. Once the broth comes to a boil, add the potatoes and then cover and cook for about eight minutes. While the potatoes are cooking and the chicken's finishing up, let's go ahead and overlap one more step. Cut pie crust crosswise into 12 slices. We'll bake each of these and use them to top the chicken pot pie. Once you've made each of your slices, transfer them to a parchment lined jelly roll pan. We'll bake these for about seven minutes or until they're browned and crispy. It's been about eight minutes, so let's go ahead and stir in the peas and carrots. It's been about two minutes. Watch that steam. So add your cooked chicken to the pan. Give this a stir. Now combine flour and broth. This will help to thicken the chicken pot pie. Just whisk all of this together. So gradually stir this mixture in and cook for about two minutes or until the liquid is thick. Once the mixture is bubbly and thick, go ahead and turn off the heat. Add fresh thyme, dried rub sage, and pepper. Then give this a stir. Then remove the bay leaf. All right, I think my pastry strips are just about done, so it's almost time to eat. Talk about the ultimate and comfort food. And what I like about this recipe is how the pastry strips stand in for the traditional crust, cuts way back on the cook time and on the calories. I hope you enjoy this quick and simple meal for your dinner tonight.